Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Now this particular video is about an update regarding your SRTP 2020. So as you can see on the on the official website over here now, uh, there are two three more notifications. The first one over here it says that due to network and server problem, final list will be declared by tomorrow morning. Uh, the next thing which is important to be noted is that uh, there are few WhatsApp groups have been created and I guess most of you are being added in those groups right those who have applied in the program and those which were having their names either in this particular list that is in the NEIST list or in the provisional list both of the candidates are now added in the groups okay if you are not added in whatsapp group just wait for a while you will be added in some of that okay so uh, this is what is happening because I uh, I got my students who got uh, added in the whatsapp group yesterday in the morning also and few got yesterday in the evening also so there are different numbers of groups the group name is like CSIR NEIST SRTP 2020 and it goes like by the group number like 1 2 3 and it goes so on okay so by far I know that group number 47 up till group number 47 has been created now here if you look upon so that you have few more uh, links which says that it says first of all that the program will start on 22nd of June so we have to wait for a few more days to for the for the program to start and the other thing is that click below option uh, to join the live session so there are a few live sessions uh, which are going on the youtube channel of srtp there is also facebook live session which is going on and there is also microsoft uh, like it, it goes through the microsoft uh, pr platform okay so these are some of the live sessions which are uh, being done daily like orientation programs and all which tell you about the program and what is going to happen in the program okay so i'll suggest you to watch all these all of them uh, in the previous video also i told you to join the facebook page of srtp so here also you can just join that page the other thing over here you can see lab wise result uh, will be declared soon so there is no lab wise result till now but there is a final list of students which is being uh, uploaded and there is a uh, like there is a page which is created in which you have different projects you have name of students under that okay so i'll just show you that particular page so the page goes like neist.res.in slash srtp2020 slash project1.php if you click uh, like if you if you write that down on the on the uh, chrome browser and if you just press enter you will get on this particular page now here you have different projects you can see there are 16 projects over here and on each project you have the project title project description and the project students so for the project one we have title as frequency magnitude relation and hazard estimation now uh, if you look upon the project description so if you click upon that particular link you will get to see this particular pdf where all the details about the project has been given like what actually if they are planning to do in this particular project like a, a brief kind of information about it is given okay fine let's get back to our page then the project students if you just click over here you will get a list of students who have been selected on this particular project okay for this particular project so you will see that there is a there is a big pdf file and uh, which has actually 14 pages in it and there are a lot of students okay so a uh, few of them does not have this uh, uh, like the acknowledgement numbers or the enrollment number of these offline candidates is not there so their name is just given over here right and this is how it goes so you have around 554 students in the first project so they have divided these uh, candidates this is final list just mark this that it is given it's a final list of selected candidates so these all are selected okay in the same way if you keep on clicking the different project you will see that the project title will change and the number of uh, project students like what project students they are taking in that also changes based upon the number okay so on the second project you have the interdisciplinary approach of precision agriculture now over here again you can see the project description keep on clicking it keep on checking that uh, where you have uh, so um, your name would be there in so, so yeah these are the detail of that particular project okay let's talk about the project students so in this project you have few students in it as well those who were having interest related to agriculture and all okay so their name has been given in this particular list uh, there are 37 pages in this particular list and if you look so there are all overall 100 like 1602 students 
in this particular list okay so all those students have been shortlisted and see these are all final list of the candidates so these all are allotted uh, for this particular project in the same way if you go on and if you keep on checking the different projects you will find out that actually all the 16,000 students which they were talking about in the previous posts or in the previous notifications they have been allotted certain projects okay so it goes like that rest of the details about how it is going to start and what you have to do in the project uh, who is your mentor those details will be provided on the website very soon in on this particular uh, like this particular link okay lab wise result will be given over here and for now what you can do is first thing is that if you are added in the whatsapp group just discuss among your friends in the whatsapp group or just discuss among the students in the whatsapp group that which project has been allotted to them okay most probably if your uh, group is allotted to let's say project number eight so you will be also allotted over there just click over there check out your name in that project list and just be assured that yes you are selected so that is how you can just check out that whether you are selected or not in case you have been not added to any of the whatsapp group i will recommend ki for now you can just keep on clicking and keep on checking all the project students list whether your name is there or not or if your name is nowhere anywhere in the list just wait for some time because they are updating more names so if you click on project number 12 as far as i am recording this particular video right now up till project 11 it has been updated for project 12 the project title and the project students have not been allotted and they have not been updated on the website so you have to wait for some time uh, there are one two three four and five more projects which has to be updated a list has to be created so it is taking time but yeah it is going to happen okay so yeah so now just telling just answering your some of your queries the first one which i got to hear from many of you that uh, you have not given your whatsapp number you have given your some other number okay so what about that so for those candidates who have given their some other number uh, i will recommend ki make a whatsapp i make a whatsapp account with that particular number which you have given you can clone up your uh, whatsapp app in the parallel universe app or something you can do some like some technical stuff of your own and just make one more whatsapp account with that particular number and you will be added in the whatsapp group let's say you thought that this whatsapp group is a spam and you just uh, uh, left that whatsapp group if it happened with you if you have left that whatsapp group uh, in the starting itself you have been added but you left it out so i'll recommend to send a mail to the uh, to that particular authority the mail which mail id which is available on the website so you can just click over there and you can just send them your whatsapp number and tell them to get added in a, that particular whatsapp group you might be knowing that whatsapp group right that in which whatsapp group you were earlier so just tell them that you you by mistake you just left that group you want to get added in it again so that is something which you can do for those whose name is nowhere anywhere uh, there are two possibilities either your name is not updated yet or you are not selected uh, the can the condition why you will not be selected will be just because your form will be incomplete if your form will be incomplete incomplete form means uh, either you have not submitted your photo id your photo basically photograph basic or you might not have mentioned your research interest properly so it, it it's just depending upon csir that whom they are selecting i guess they have selected almost all of the students there are only few which are left out uh, the one which they have not sent the photograph or the one which they have sent an incomplete uh, like uh, application right so those have not been selected so this is all about this particular program now you have a particular whatsapp group you have uh, been assigned with a particular project uh, you will be assigned with a mentor very soon your project will start from 22nd of june so all the best to you guys just work finally just have a like just have experience of this particular research training program just see how research is being done offline it's all work from home so that is also one of the question people ask me that whether it is work from home or what we have to do so it's totally work from home you don't have to go anywhere just have to sit at your home whatever work is assigned to you just do that and that's it guys so rest of the details will be provided to you by csir i am not authority to provide any detail from my side the one which i am telling you is just to clear all the uh, like whatever uh, doubts you are having in your minds okay so that's all for this particular video guys Thank you so much for watching i hope now everything is clear if you want to ask anything you can ask that in the comment section below from my side whatever i thought that these things are needed to be cleared up i just told you that's all from my side guys thank you so much for watching and have a great day bye bye hey guys i'm a verified educator at an academy 
and along with that i am also teaching live at an academy plus to access my live classes you can take an academy plus subscription now an academy plus offers some interesting features apart from live classes which include detailed and complete explanation of a particular course then there you have problem a discussion for self evaluation you can also watch recorded version of the class in case if you miss out any live session you have regular doubt clearing sessions for doubt clearing and to clarify all your problems you also get access to the whatsapp group to clear and discuss problem among the other plus students now if you have found these features interesting and want to join an academy plus i'll recommend you to use my referral code that is n underscore huda to get 10 percent discount on the subscription fee now that's all about an academy plus let's continue with our video